The use of EPC's bar chip synthetic fibre reinforcement in tunnelling and underground construction has grown significantly over the past 15 years. EPC's bar chip synthetic fibres have been specified to replace steel fibre and mesh in hundreds of kilometres of tunnelling works. The A3 Hindhead Tunnel is a dual carriageway board highway tunnel and the longest underland road tunnel in the UK. Designer Mott MacDonald designed the tunnels with a permanent sprayed concrete lining and incorporated the primary lining into the final design. The initial shotcrete mix called for steel fibres. However, the cost advantages and the performance of EPC's bar chip fibre led to the specification being changed from steel fibre to EPC's bar chip synthetic fibre reinforcement. The Helsinki Metro West, due for completion in late 2014, consists of 14 kilometres of twin tube rail tunnels with cross passages every 150 metres. Excavation was carried out using drill and blast with initial primary lining and a bar chip reinforced secondary shotcrete linings. Costing around 950 million US dollars, the West Metro is the largest infrastructure project in Finland. The use of EPC's bar chip reinforcement in the secondary shotcrete lining removed the risk of corrosion and helped the project achieve its 120 year design life. The 240 million US dollar T Connection Road upgrade project is one of Norway's largest infrastructure projects comprising the longest subsea tunnel in Norway, the 8.9 km Karmoy Road Tunnel. The Karmoy Tunnel consists of a 4 km, a 3.75 km and a 1.15 km branch. The three branches meet at a subsea roundabout 130 m below ground level and 60 m below sea level. The ground control in the Karmoy Tunnel is bar chip synthetic fibre, reinforced primary and secondary shotcrete lining with rock bolts. The 3.5 km extension Santiago Metro Line 5 comprises 230 square metre caverns and 70 square metre double track tubes constructed just 7 metres below city streets and represents some of the most advanced NATAM design to date. Ground support comprises a permanent sprayed concrete lining. The original design was modified using the concept of moment equivalence and the two layers of mesh, C295 and C378, were placed with 7 kilograms per cubic metre of EPC's bar chip synthetic fibre and the original thickness was maintained. Completed in 2012, California's Devil Slide Road Tunnel was the first tunnel built in California in 40 years. Devil Slide was excavated using the new Austrian tunnel method with both road header and drill and blast excavation. EPC's bar chip synthetic fibres were used in the primary shotcrete lining after meeting the 320 joules at 7 days RDP specification with the lowest dose rate and lowest cost per joule. Major projects all constructed with bar chip synthetic fibre reinforced primary and secondary shotcrete linings. EPC's team of industry leaders deliver expert shotcrete and concrete advice, expert synthetic fibre reinforcement advice and engineered and finite element analysis designs. When performance matters, choose Elasto Plastic Concrete for synthetic fibre experts.